Take this cover off here. You can use a trim tool, try to get behind here, or even from up top, just pop it out. There's a little clip right there, and then it slides up. And there's a cover right here. Just get underneath there with the trim tool. Pop that off. Use a Phillips head screwdriver. Take this screw out. And take this screw out, Phillips head screwdriver. Open this up. This is another one right there. And take this one out right here. This is a plastic one, so I would do this by hand. And then slide this out, it's just like a push pin. Now underneath here, use the trim tool, just pry up. There's a little clip that you gotta push on. Just push on that clip. And pop this up. And then you'll have to slide it back a little bit. There's a clip on the front, right there. Disconnect these connectors, just push down. There's a connector there. And take these two screws out. Same Phillips head screwdriver. And slide it out. And take this screw out. Same Phillips head screw. Then with some trim tools, get behind the door panel and just pry it out. There you go. And grab the door panel. And you just slide it up slightly. Pull it out. Then I'm just gonna pop these cables out right here and just let the door panel hang down. You don't have to take it off completely. Disconnect the connector right here. Push down, slide it out. Use a 10 millimeter socket. Take these two nuts off first. Then hold the mirror, support the mirror, and then take the last one off. And you can grab the mirror and just slide it out. Take the new mirror and slide the wiring harness through. Line up the studs. And put the nuts on. Once you get that nut on, then you can let go from the outside. Put the other nuts on. And snug these down. And connect the connector. And slide these cables back in position. Slide the top on. Make sure the wires come through here. And with the door pins lined up, just give it a tap. And put this screw back in position. And tighten it down. And reinstall this bracket and put these screws in. Tighten these down. Connect the connectors. And make sure you slide this end first. Slide that in. And lock it down. And put these screws in. Tighten these down. Put the cover on. And put that push pin in there. And just push it down. And put this cover on. Make sure you slide this end in first. Line it up. Lock it down.